When mankind first discovered that by rubbing two sticks together you could create fire, life as we know it really began. Now you could stay warm in the winter, see things in the dark, cook food, and snuggle up with your loved ones without having to overdo the layers of animal skins. People still love natural flames from real tangible fuels like coal and wood. If there's an open fire or a stove in a house, everyone naturally gravitates towards it. It's life enhancing, sociable and an element of our prehistoric past that still fascinates. The only trouble with these wonderful natural flames is that once the fuel's burning, you're not really in control anymore. OK, there are a few basic moves you can make to pep up the fire. For instance, you can get down on your hands and knees and give it a blow. Not a lot of fun and not that effective. Alternatively, you can fiddle about with a couple of vents at the bottom to give it a boost or calm it down. You can also get in there with a poker and give the fuel a good going over. Or you can add more fuel. But basically, that's about it. The ancient Egyptians invented bellows 5,000 years ago, and since then, well, there really hasn't been much progress. Mankind discovered how to make fire and has been strangely complacent about it ever since. Until now. Mankind's greatest discovery just got better. Nope, it's not for the TV or the video player, it's for the fire. That is a real fire in there, burning real logs, and yet, with the touch of the remote, I can switch the flames higher. There they go, it just takes a, a few seconds to establish. Or, once it's roaring, I can switch the flames down again. And that is equally important for a powerful multi-fuel stove. And again, in just a couple of seconds, those flames die down. It's basically just as controllable as a gas fire, but with real fuel. And the fuel can be logs like these or coal. Behind this door is a simple slide control, which allows you to select the type of fuel that you're using. To light the stove, you set the slider in the middle, and then once it's lit, you just return that to the type of fuel that you're burning inside. You can also adjust the height of the flames manually using this simple tool. It really is amazing how much control you have. There's even a timer. And you can set a thermostat on the remote, so the stove automatically adjusts the heat to your preferred temperature, wherever you are in the room. The secret, of course, is inside the stove. The patented design is unique. The remote operates a motor, which moves a series of shutters to direct air into the top of the stove, as well as the bottom. A side effect of this is that there's a constant cascade of superheated air running down the inside of the glass, so the glass stays beautifully clear for longer. This particular stove is the Stanford from Euroheat. It has timeless, simple lines that fit equally well in contemporary or traditional fireplaces, and it's available in different colour options and three sizes. But that's only part of the story. Euroheat also offers the remote control option across their Harmony range of traditional stoves. No less than five stove sizes and various colour options for both stoves and flue fittings. If you want a totally different look for your home, there's a comprehensive range of insert stoves as well, opening up even more design possibilities. Whichever one you choose, our stoves are the result of more than 150 years of continuous manufacturing excellence, combined with pure 21st century technology. They're cleaner, more efficient and easier to use than anything you might have seen before. And if you prefer to be hands-on, you can be. Well, like all the best ideas, it is breathtakingly simple in principle and unbelievable to experience in practice.